there! In today's video, I'll show you how to transfer files from your Samsung Galaxy A55 to any Windows PC or a laptop. Let's get started. So, as a first step, we would need to take a cable which has one side Type-C and the second one USB Type-A. The USB Type-A we would need to plug into our computer and this side we would need to plug into our phone to the charging port which is located at the bottom part. So, let's do it. And this is it. Now we will need to unlock our phone. And as a next step, allow access to the phone data so you'd be able to transfer them to your PC. So now we will need to work with our PC. As a first step, open File Explorer on your PC and then on the left side, try to find a tab which is named this PC. Here you'd be able to see your phone as your Google account name A55. Click on it and here go to the internal storage. So, as you can see, we got here some interesting folders like music, ringtones, audio books and more. But, usually people want to transfer their photos or videos that they have made on their phone. To find everything that you have in your camera roll, we would need to go to this folder which is named DCAM. Click on it and as you can see, here we got three categories. Camera, screen recordings and screenshots. Let's go to the camera. And now the main question, how to transfer files? So, we have a few options how to do it. First one is that you would need to create a folder or find a folder that you would like to transfer the files to. As you can see, I have created this one on my desktop and I will open it like this and you can see it's completely empty. Now, we will need to go back to our camera folder and here choose a file or files that we would like to transfer. I'll choose this one and we have two options how to transfer it. The first one is you would need to hold your finger on the left click on the photo and then when the photo is following your mouse slowly put it on the folder that you have chosen to transfer. Then release your finger and this is it. Now your photo has successfully transferred to this folder and the original will stay on your phone. And the second option is much easier. We would need to choose our file right click on it, here click copy, then go to our folder and right click on any empty place and here click paste. On Windows 11 it looks like this, this icon. Click on it and the photo has been successfully transferred and the original still stays on your phone. And this is it. After this you can close all of these folders and disconnect your phone from the cable and the photos that you have transferred to this folder will stay on your PC and the originals will be on your phone. And this is it for today. I hope this video was helpful for you and thank you so much for watching.